Why don't you tell us, Abby, what we were going to do? So for the act of kindness <laughs> today is we're going to give a pizza to some homeless people. Er, so we saw a lot of people yeah. on this strip we're yeah. in Barstow um, that are homeless and some of them were asking um, for stuff as we walked around and so we were getting pizza for ourselves. So we decided to do that for our random act of kindness today. So we got pizza. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Let's hope that goes well. There are a few things that um, we would do, or I would encourage you to do if you decide to give away a whole pizza to somebody who's hanging out on the streets. Uh, the first is to give them dignity by instead of saying, I think that you're needy or whatever, just kind of coach your kids to be, say something like, hey, we're just doing random ki acts of kindness when we decided to give you away a pizza and, and here you go, here's the pizza. And we decided not to say anything other than that because we didn't think it was necessary. Second of all, we had an adult go with them. Meg went with um, Avi while I stayed in the car with the other kids because we didn't want to overwhelm them with like all of us at the same time. Another thing is, is that we chose somebody who is by themselves rather than a group of people. And as always, just make sure it looks like a safe situation. Pretty sure the guy that we gave the pizza to was either like entirely still asleep or um, drugged up, but that that was completely fine. He was like, oh, okay. And um, that was it. Uh, so it, our conversation wasn't very long. And uh, hopefully they liked the pizza and the little note that went with it, which just pretty much said, hey, we think you're valuable. And that's all we're doing is just acknowledging that. I hope that helps. helps. And if you do that, um, a random act of kindness, let me know because I'm curious to see how it goes with you guys. Um, little Caesars usually has $5 pizzas. So that's what we did. Bye.